Their floor is covered with shampoo bottles, baby products, and cleaning supplies. Eric and Emily Whitlock are sorting items for the new charity they've started right in their Rexburg apartment. We are Rexburg for Refugees. Rexburg for Refugees serves local and international refugees by collecting and delivering donations to humanitarian organizations that help refugees in need. Mostly what we just do is ask for these donations and then transport them because that's the biggest need that um, the refugee crisis has right now is just actual items. Each week, the Whitlocks travel through the Upper Valley picking up donations. Once a month, the Whitlocks transport these items to the College of Southern Idaho's Refugee Program and to Salt Lake's chapter for the International Rescue Committee. We try to do a lot of research and find out what the needs are, and so we're not just giving, and but we're giving with you know, education and looking at mm -hmm. what are actually the needs and how can we best meet those needs here in a community like Southeast Idaho that's so giving yeah. and so willing to, you know, make a difference for whatever the needs are. Since starting less than two weeks ago, the community has given a positive response. And since we started it, we've seen, it feels like we felt a pretty big, we filled a pretty big void in the community because once we started Rexburg for Refugees, so many people said, I love this idea, I've been wanting to help, or I felt inspired to help too, but didn't know how. And we just provided a vehicle for people to help. Ian Zollinger, student housing coordinator for Rexburg for Refugees, says he and his wife gather donations from the student apartment complex they manage. We're all, we're all neighbors. Um, and we, when you see people who need help, you help them. That's just what you do. He says he's seen firsthand the impact of refugees receiving donations after serving a Latter-day Saint mission in Kennewick, Washington. He says he saw many refugees there. They've gone through things that I can't even imagine that that's just changed their lives. And any help, they, they, they really appreciate it. And they know that they don't want to take this for granted. So far, the Whitlocks have collected over 600 items to donate and are anticipating more. To find out how to contribute to Rexburg for Refugees, you can find their page on Facebook or go to the link below. In Rexburg, I'm Natalia Hepworth, eastidahonews.com.